hackathon, I would say, is a collaboration between developers, project managers, designers, as well as people who are good at pitching to build a solution from scratch in a short space of time. So it's move fast, fail quickly, move on. I guess we've all had some sort of idea that's just ticking away in the back of our minds and something like this hackathon enables people to come out of their shell, you know, form very quick teams, come up with ideas and, and get them out there and potentially get them into the real world. Well, so far it's an amazing experience. It's a place to find motivation to keep going the technology world. So far, uh, the ideas are very interesting. It's, it's really good to be part of changing everything around the world at the moment and how people communicate. So I'm really glad to be here. The hackathons and the creative ideas, just the business ideas that come out of them, serve to remind us about some of the things that we should be focusing on in our business, sometimes the smaller things. Sometimes we get distracted by very big problems and this brings us back to remember you know, the small and the niche opportunities to improve customer experience right across our business. The breadth of different countries and nationalities that have been represented here this week and I think it's about 34, 36 different countries that have participated and that kind of diversity is, is, is huge. Hackathons are really important because we need to continue to innovate. We need to continue to look for solutions that best serve our customers. We don't have all of the answers, we acknowledge that. There are so many different ways of approaching a problem to look for solutions and the level of knowledge and contribution in this room today just proves that. This is my first hackathon, so I didn't really know what to expect. I think my first impression would be that everybody's actually really friendly. It's a really nice environment to come and learn. The highlight for me has been everyone's openness. As a girl, like coming into a tech world, there isn't a lot of girls in this environment normally. But like, and that can be kind of intimidating, but something like this, you really see that like the tech environment is somewhere that people actually really work together. It's competitive, but it's not so competitive that people aren't ha happy to help. So I think that for me is the biggest thing, is like the community element of it. The breadth of support that we have had this time around. There's about 20 volunteers from Ulster Bank and RBS. There's a staff here at Dogpatch Labs. We also had a lot of companies coming in to support us. We had Nile for customer insights. We had Microsoft for technical assistance. We had Views DX for design. And we also had Entrepreneurial Spark coming in to help with the pitches. And I think that it's just created amazing combination of different skills, different types of energy, different ways of approaching a problem, and it's gone down a storm this year. For me, this weekend was about drumming up the attention from the academia side of the house, so I was involved in getting out to universities, trying to get the student population in, and to see those guys up pitching, you know, we all go through a lot of work up front, but nothing compares to going up on stage. The level of work to go from a broad idea 48 hours ago to a well-crafted pitch with a live demonstration showing the technical development over the weekend, I just thought it's on an entirely different level. On behalf of Ulster Bank, really proud to be involved in creating this platform to bring these people together over the course of the last 48 hours, which is superb. And of course, being here in Dogpatch in this working environment adds to that atmosphere. <laughs>